Welcome back for the afternoon. So our first speaker is Song Shui, who will talk about Stukas. Uh, so thank you very much for the uh, invitation and thanks the uh, organizer very much for organization and thanks everyone for coming. Uh, so uh, today I'll talk about uh, Stuka. Uh, so you know that the long long con um, conjecture is over, we have the long long co conjecture over function field and we have the long long conjecture over number field. Mm, over number field, we have uh, similar varieties, uh, and the stack of Stukas, stack of global Stukas, are the analog of similar varieties over function field. Um, that's what uh, I will talk for the uh, first and two lectures of Stuka, and then there are local Stuka which are analog of uh, rapport link space for the uh, function field. So that's uh, that uh, Emma Wehman, uh, she will talk for the third and fourth lecture. Mm, and the, uh, yes, so the Stuka, a uh, 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 little uh, history uh, about the Stuka. So it is uh, uh, invented by June Field. Uh, at the beginning, uh, she uh, he called called them uh, uh, F bundle. F means Fobinus, uh, or F uh, or Fobinus hacker bundle. You uh, we will see later in this lecture why uh, they called this name, and then he he gave them name Stuka. <laughs> I don't know why he said that. Uh, Stuka means things in German, and he said that I don't know what to give as name, so they, he just called them things. Um, and everyone can have their Stuka in their mind. And for me, it's like this. Uh, it's a Stuka with uh, 12 legs. <laughs> and in today's lecture, we will see um, uh, the, what means legs of Stuka. <laughs> uh, so, um, so in today's talk, we will talk about the geometry of uh, Stukas. And uh, in tomorrow's talk, uh, we will talk about their cohomology. Uh, let's begin by some uh, uh, setting. Uh, at, at the end of today's lecture, I will give you some uh, reference about the uh, Stukas. If I forgot, please remember me. And so uh, we, um, our setting will be about uh, function field. Uh, let let x be a curve over a finite field, um, smooth, projective, and geometrically connected. we will denote f by its function field. Or you can take a function field and let x be a curve correspond to the function field. Uh, we will use the standard notation for closed point of the curve. So fx be the uh, completion of the field. And OX be its uh, integral ring, and uh, uh, KX be the radius field. And we will take a, a reductive group. Uh, yes, SNIT uh, here is to simplify the notations. Um, for no SNIT groups, uh, uh, the notation is more complicated. 
啊，安德维维尔，嗯，做呃，人文为 consider the 呃。The shift, uh, the coefficient for automorphic forms or coefficient for shifts, we will also consider QL coefficient for L not equal to P. P is a characteristic of, uh, our finite field. So we are always in L not equal to P situation. And mm, so in the long long correspondence involve a group and uh, it's a dual long long dual group in today's talk uh, we will only use uh, the group to define a uh, stuka and uh, study some geometry of it and uh, next uh, um, in tomorrow's talk we will uh, begin to talk about uh, shifts given by sadaki geometric uh, geometric sadaki equivalence and uh, uh, at that time we will introduce the dual group so um, the dual group we are for tomorrow. Today only G is enough. And let's begin by uh, automorphic side. Uh, we have the uh, space of automorphic forms. So let uh, uh, A be the uh, ring of a death of F. And let uh, O be the ring of integral a death. We have the uh, vector space of automorphic forms. So it's just a, a space of continuous function with compact support on this set of double quotient. So we quotient. GF one hand and the other side uh, we quotient uh, G of O in coefficient in QL bar. Uh, means uh, the the uh, the the element is in the O O X, so Adele is the uh. This integral Adele is this. Yes, perhaps this is not the standard notation. And uh, so uh, here, um, for simplicity, uh, here we first consider the everywhere and ramified automorphic forms. So we quotient by this group. Uh, of course, we can consider ramified automorphic forms. We quotient by some, by some uh, uh, group uh, with uh, some level. Uh, if I have time, I will talk at the end of today's talk. If not, I talk at the end of tomorrow's talk about uh, um, uh, uh, about ramified case. And today, uh, let's just begin by the everywhere and ramified case. Uh, so, um, um, yes, for function field, this is what we call space of automorphic forms, um, different to number field uh, case. This space may have infinite dimension. Uh, we will say uh, later uh, this phenomenon. Uh, it is equipped with the action uh, of uh, Heike algebra. So I note this global Heike algebra. It's just continuous function with compact support on this double coset.
uh, action is by convolution from the right. Uh, and the curve gives us a geometric point of view of this. I have a V dictionary say so that for this site. Uh, in fact, we have an equivalence of this when the uh, G bundles on the curve. Uh, because if you have uh, G bundles on the curve, it's trivialized outside some finite point. Uh, uh, it's, and it's trivial on each um, formal disk around this point. So uh, a G bundle is given by a, you, you glue these two trivialization together and the glue data is just uh, uh, give you an element in this. And uh, uh, if you change the trivialization on the uh, on the outside some finite set, it's uh, you quotient this, and if you change the trivialization on this, uh, you quotient this, and if you change trivialization on this uh, uh, formal disk, you quotient out this, so you will get this uh, uh, bijection. Uh, uh, yes. Uh, so G bundles, uh, um, it's a, uh, it means a G tosser on the curve. So it's a scheme uh, over. The, um, over x, x by g, the x, uh, and the map is g equivalent, and the local need for topology, tau topology is isomorphic to x times g. Mm. Um, yeah, yes, um, for uh, for example, mm, so your uh, when G is GLN, G bundles are, you have this uh, Morita equivalence. Uh, Um, between the G bundles on curve and vector rank n vector bundles on the curve, given by uh, Morita equivalent. And in particular, if your curve is uh, P one, uh, these are just uh, uh, the O wins. <laughs> yes, yes. From this, yes. uh, uh, I don't know. It's ex exact for you. <laughs> uh, yes. So um, this is in fact uh, equivalent as a uh, um, groupoid. So uh, here we set as a groupoid when the isomorphism the isomorphism of G bundles, and this uh, we set as a set quotient by a group. Uh, it doesn't matter as groupoid or as set. We have this, mm. and that uh, give us a, a. We want to we want to geometrize uh, go to further and geometrize this. Uh, so uh, we will now introduce the Bungi, the classified stack of G bundles to consider this uh, family. And concretely, uh, as functor, mm. for any affine scheme, uh, 
or FQ uh, ice point of bond G is, uh, I have to get this set. <laughs> S point of We keep on those over the product of i, x times i. Uh, so in this talk, uh, uh, every product are over uh, f cube. Uh, and this is a. Uh, in fact, uh, algebraic stack. Uh, even uh, art and stack, which is locally looks like a scheme quotient by a group. It is locally of finite type. Uh, smooth or FQ. So boundary is over spike FQ. Uh, here is an example. Mm. Like uh, uh, we already say that the um, bound GLN classify the uh, vector bundle of rank N over X times S and the bound SL2, for example, uh, it classify um, it classify rank two um, vector bundle on the curve when the trivial determinant, and especially in the uh, example we talked uh, before, when x is p1, uh, this is just uh, classified by this. They are classified by this. So from this, we, we see that there are infinitely many um, Wrong two vector bundle when we were in determinant. Uh, so you'll say that here this 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 is an infinitely set. That's why this has the infinite dimension in this case, for example. Uh, ice uh, ice always uh, a fine scheme uh, over FQ. Uh, so. Oh, oh, yes, here, um, uh, here is uh, some, uh, some, uh, uh, when the case of this. Uh, yes, it dimension something like uh, something. There are some formula like this. G is a uh, genus of curve. Uh, Calculate by the uh, H1 of the curve, some, something. Mm. So, uh, in the rest of uh, the talk, uh, we will 
fibrous in month. The space of automorphic forms. For us, it's the uh, F. Um, because by that equivalence, uh, G top G bundles on the curve X is just uh, the FQ point of boundary. When you take S spec FQ, you just get uh, uh, X. Mm. So um, for us, this is our space of automorphic forms. So that's the first uh, geometrialization. Um, we want to go steer further to have some action of a Galois group of the function field. For the moment, we only have action of a Heike. Uh, on this, there are Heike correspondence. Uh, so for to get action of Galois group to involve this, we need introduce a, a stack of Stukas. Uh, you will see that uh, stack of Stukas, they are generalization of FQ point of Bungi mm -hmm. and the cohomology of stack of Stukas will general, generalize the space of automorphic forms. Yeah. So how do you, uh, like, what sense continuous functions? Right? Yeah. Like, what's the topology of the discrete topology. So it's just uh, functions support a finite set of points. So uh, let I be a finite set. Uh, so in, in the following k will be a number <laughs> to index the site. I, I will never use k as a, a notation of field. So it's it's a, a finite set. So let I be a finite set. Uh, so it will be the. Mm, Paul likes Paul's of Stuka. Mm, and first we introduce the uh, uh, hiker stack. I will say to J and this is uh, likes. Uh, so the uh, ice often scheme over FQ, as that's now the functor of the high stack. Uh, it's a group point, group point that uh, first twins some point, some ice point on the curve. And uh, um, some um, some G tossers on the curve. So the I say the ice point of boundary. So these are G tossers on X times ice, uh, and a chain of modifications. So I use dotted uh, uh, flash, dotted arrow to uh, denote the modifications. Uh, what I mean, these modifications. So a dotted. Uh, arrow means uh, it, it is an isomorphism outside the, uh, the iced uh, like so this means the graph uh, of x in x uh, so here 
the notation is Uh, I didn't uh, heard the question. Uh, oh, uh, this? Yeah, I, I will. I will finish this, and then you tell me. And this is graph of uh, x i in x times i, uh, which means that uh, this modification is outside uh, x one. This modification outside x two. This modification outside x k. Uh, so each time a modification is outside the uh, outside the corresponding legs, leg. So what other question? Yeah. So x one to x k should be uh, pointing x to the k. Um, product of x. Uh, so these are a uh, ice point of the curve, which means each x i is a map from x to x. Uh, it, 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 it's the, the notation I use. So each x i means the map from x to x, and its curve, uh, its graph is uh, is uh, a close game. The PI are globally defined, right? And there are lower modifications in the in the usual sense. The coherent sheets, the unicorn one. Okay. Um, we will see coherent sheets when the co-colors. It will come later in an example. Uh, Mm, I will talk about this modification in more detail later. For the moment, uh, uh, for the moment, each phi i, um, it is an isomorphism over over this, so it is uh, defined only over this. Okay. I use the notation dotted point uh, to simplify. Okay. So each phi i is defined over this. Yes, yes. Uh, so, uh, it, so uh, these points, uh, these G bundles, and this modification, they are all data um, in this uh, groupoid. Mm. We have a uh, uh, map from this hiker stack to Bungie. Uh, so every product is over FQ, as I said. Uh, so this map uh, is given by the projection to the first G bundle and the projection to the last G bundle, um, which means that uh, it's... Uh, it's sent send these uh, modifications. To the uh, first one and last one. Uh, 
And in fact, this is what we usually use for the hacker correspondence for Bungie. Uh, it's uh, some modification of the G bundle. Mm, we have this map. Uh, now we will consider a Cartesian uh, diagram. So on the bottom, I consider the map, which is identity for the first factor and for business for the second factor. Uh, so Bungie is a stack over FQ, so there are uh, absolute for business for FQ. Uh, uh, so what it's two for ice point. So you have uh, As an uh, always assigned scheme of FQ. So for business, uh, as is the identity on the topological space and the uh, um, power of Q on the uh, flexor shift. The so your and total for business morphism for scheme over FQ. Um, and it send a G, G tosser over X times S um, to the inverse image of this um, because uh, when you do forbidness on boundary and uh, it's the same as you take this composition so you do forbidness in fact only on the scheme s uh, but not on x Uh, and this, uh, uh, in later of the talk, we will note this uh, uh, small toe of G. So we write a little, small little toe on the left of G means the inverse image by Fobinus. And Fobinus always on the taste scheme. And the stack of Stuka is defined to be the fiber product of this diagram. Uh, associate to I. Point to come with I post. And we notate uh, to K associated to G with I post. Um, this I will explain in one minute. So that's the very first definition of a stack of Stuka. Uh, a very easy exercise is to try to write down its ice point, the ice point of a stack of Stuka. What I will write now. Uh, so the functor point of view, the ice point of Stuka, so uh, first there are some pause legs. Mm -hmm. And there are some G bundles with uh, a chain of modification. 
as in the Haiku uh, stack. Uh, and when some data, uh, some more data is an uh, isomorphism uh, between the last G tosser and the inverse image of Fubinus of the first G tosser, this data is given by the definition of fiber product here. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And uh, this is is also equivalent to say that uh, I have one modification. And uh, the the last one I it is this one. just by definition to identify these two. Um, and what we call the Stuka is the ice point of a stack of Stuka. Um, but usually we um, do not think about uh, uh, Stuka. We consider the stack of all the Stuka. Uh, and an uh, immediate example. Uh, is that, so I said I is a, a finite site, but we can also take I uh, as an empty site. So, if I is an empty set in the definition of a high cost stack, uh, so if uh, uh, there's no these uh, legs uh, and just uh, uh, no modifications, just a uh, uh, G tosser. So, if you don't have this and don't have modification, the hike stack is just uh, equal to G zero. Mm, so in this case, when I is empty set, we say the hike um, that's boundary. And in that diagram, if you put a uh, boundary in the place of hike, so the vertical map is just a diagonal map. Uh, what you get, the fiber product, is uh, um, just the uh, FQ point of boundary. The... Yes. Yes, it's uh, isomorphism everywhere. It's given by the data because uh, uh, Because uh, on the bottom, um, what's this? It sent a G0 to um, G0, G0. So the fiber product means you have an actual data of, of isomorphism between these two. So that's a standard definition algebraic geometry. Uh, you will see. Um, so in this case, so if the hiker is boundary, so this map is a diagonal map. And here you have your identity and a Um So the fiber product is just to the FQ point of boundary, uh, which means that the Stuka, when there's uh, uh, no 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 legs, uh, it is a discrete stack, which is 
identified with FQ point of Bonji. Mm. Uh, sorry, uh, excuse me, could you, um, it's about this two line or? Uh, for this or for this? For this. Uh, so the the definition is uh, you have uh, uh, you have the data of uh, uh, some point and some G bundles on the curve and uh, some modifications between these G bundles. Uh, and when the isomorphism of last one, when the forbidness of the first one. Oh, your question is just what I try to talk. Uh, yeah. <laughs> next, next. So, sorry. Um, so uh, what's there is a Stuka wins uh, intermediate modification. And now uh, let's say, uh, let's look at Stuka uh, without uh, intermediate modification. Which means that we can define a, a hyperstack without intermediate modification. Uh, like this. I just keep the first and the last one. Uh, and I just keep the first and last. I call it a uh, five and uh, five. Uh, now we uh, now the modification is outside the, the union of all the graphs. Um, so uh, the hyperstack without intermediate modification uh, is just uh, the the modified to G bundles and the modification uh, uh happen on on the union of all the point. So it's an isomorphism outside the, the union of points. And uh, um, evidently, we have a map from another one to this one. Mm.
factor to share everything in your world. So the map is Is your sense this? Um, so this point you don't see, and you forgot. You just forgot the intermediate chitosis. So the map is the composition of all these maps. Since each of these are uh, so morphism outside the one graph, the composition is isomorphism outside the union of graphs. Uh, and that is the map of legs just like this. Um, um, is it clear? Are there questions about this? Is the definition of the unsaid is still because the information of the information is still unsaid? Uh, this? Yeah. Uh, no. The, the definition is just you have modifications that are isomorphism outside union of graphs. So uh, what is this? Uh, this map is uh, uh, something about this map. So it's isomorphic over uh, this uh, this open sub scheme, which definition is uh, So this is a uh, uh, open substack where all these legs are uh, are uh, two uh, two two distinct. Uh, when all these uh, legs are different, uh, this map is just an isomorphism. You can uh, re re you can recover recover this intermediate modification. But when the legs become the same. Uh, it's more complicated. So, in the data point of the Shuka, like the first kind, yeah. we don't remember the order of the those things? Uh, this? Yes. We, we remember the order of these things. Um, and uh, and then we don't forget at least the order, isn't it? Like, uh, but like the sigma k. Um, okay. 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 So for the moment, we keep the order in this definition. Um, and later you will say the a very important morphism, partial forbidden morphism. They change this kind of orders. Uh, but all different order give you same cohomology. That's a very important property. Uh, for the moment, we remember order. In both, in both. Uh, there's no order for this. Uh, no order for this one, but you have order for this one. Uh, first leg, second leg. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, it's not it's not quite easy <laughs> and let's pass to the next step uh, so that's a uh, haiku and uh, if you use this haiku similarly you have a uh, uh, stuka Uh, as before. So for Stuka, you also have this uh, from this Stuka with intermediate modification to this uh, Stuka without intermediate modification. And as as before, this map is also uh, isomorphic over uh, over uh, open subscheme where all the legs are different. Uh, and even more, this morphism is uh, small. Uh, no, uh, since I didn't put bounds, it, uh, it's not quite correct, so that's like this. Uh, so that's just uh, the uh, very first definition of a stack of Stukas. For the moment, they are very uh, huge things, inductive limit of algebraic stacks, because I didn't put any bound on these modifications. And to introduce uh, the some bound on the modifications to get learning algebraic stack. Uh, and also to, uh, we will introduce the uh, Benison Jun field, I found Grassmannian, and we will see how to, how the bounds on this Benison Jun field, I found Grassmannian. And they are also local model of the stack of Stukas. Uh, Uh, I think in the rest of time, I will just uh, um, state uh, uh, I found um, Grassmann, the local version. And the next, uh, tomorrow, we'll talk about Benison Junfield, I found Grassmann, and uh, look at its relation with Stuka. Uh, so that's the is a, a loop group. And so it is a, a and scheme, which represents uh, this functor to some uh, uh, k, k of field. To this and uh, uh, ILG is a positive loop group. And um, it is a functor send each uh, algebra to um, this. And the Afan Grassmanny.
mm. the functor of uh, 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 so the functor is sent uh, algebra uh, to this quotient. <laughs> uh, yes, and sometimes uh, in the literature, we just write uh, This means uh, FPQC quotient. Uh, I will just record the uh, the Schubert variety, and then we finish for today. Uh, oh, a, a general remark is we will only consider a reduced subscheme in the following. And so the positive loop group uh, acts on Arthur Grassmannian uh, from the left, and the of speed, uh, they are indexed by the uh, dominant COVID, set uh, of dominant COVID. So we fix a uh, barrier in G and uh, a maximal, please maximal torus. Uh, so if you have a, so this is just a, this, uh, so you have a, the loop group for, for GM, send to loop group for T, for lambda, you can associate this T to something in the torus. And then it sent to the loop group of G and then to grass many. So we still notate G lambda, T lambda. Uh, and we have the uh, orbit associated to this. So we notate uh, lambda. So it's a uh, orbit. And we have the Cartan decomposition. of the Grassmannian by its uh, uh, orbit. Uh, and we define smaller than lambda to be the uh, SK the closure. Uh, and so this is what is your uh, robot variety. Uh, and uh, we have a fact. So this is, uh, in fact, uh, uh, in the ZHSK closure, it is union given by the uh, orbit. Uh, when the uh, some dominant weight smaller than lambda. Um, yes. Uh, Perhaps one example of this, then I finish. So this 
uh, and this uh, may not be um, smooth, the Schubert varieties. If you have, uh, for example, when you have minuscule uh, weight, you always have smooth one. So this is uh, smooth. Inside there is only one orbit. Um, but this one for dominant COVID, which is not minuscule. Uh, in this one, you have union of two orbit. Mm, and this is something of uh, dimension two. And this is the, the singular point. And so some example of this. Mm, so I will stop for now. Uh, and tomorrow we will see some uh, uh, family version of this over the uh, I copy of the curve. And we will see a map from stack of Shiduka to the family version of this. I thank Grace Manning.